Hello, Danny from Surfer here, and welcome to Mastering AI Search Visibility. Before we dive in, I want you to think about the last time you needed an answer. Did you Google it, or did you ask ChatGPT? No judgment. If you chose the second option, you're not alone. Millions of people are skipping search engines and going straight to AI or using a combination of the two for more comprehensive answers. This isn't SEO as you knew it. We've entered the era of AI search, and this course will teach you how to master it. Here's the proof. Between mid-2024 and early 2025, traffic from AI search tools surged by more than 1,200%. And for the first time in a decade, Google's market shares dropped below 90%. That's a huge signal. People aren't just Googling it anymore. They're turning to ChatGPT, Gemini, and Perplexity to get answers. Search hasn't disappeared. People will always want to find things, and businesses will always need to be found. But how search happens? That's already changing. Instead of scrolling through SERPs, people are asking AI tools to search for them. Instead of 10 blue links, they're getting one synthesized answer. Instead of you telling your story, AI is telling your story back to your audience. That's why AI search optimization matters. And it works on two levels. Findability, by making your brand and your content show up in AI-driven answers. And citation and source control, ensuring your content is the one AI uses, cites, and spreads. Because when your words are the ones AI repeats, you don't just show up, you shape the narrative. If you've heard terms like GEO, LLMO, or AEO, or even AISEO floating around lately, and you're wondering what they actually mean, why they matter, and what to do with that information, you're in the right place. We prefer the term AI search optimization because it's the most encompassing and future-proof. At Surfer, we believe AI search optimization is the biggest shift in brand discovery since search engines first appeared. And here's the good news. We've already built the playbook. We're not outsiders speculating about the future, and we're not another company claiming SEO is dead. Surfer has been a leader in content optimization for nearly a decade, helping thousands of businesses get visible where it matters. Now, we're leading again in AI search. We've built an R&D and engineering team focused on AI search, constantly testing, analyzing, and publishing studies. We apply these strategies ourselves. Today, AI search already drives 25% of Surfer's new revenue each month, up from 15% in March 2025. Crazy, right? And everything you'll learn here is built from that experience. Data, testing, and thousands of client cases. We know what we're talking about because we've been immersing ourselves in it for months. We've got skin in the game for several reasons. So who is this course for? This course is designed for CMOs, marketing leaders, and content teams who want clarity and results, not just regurgitated, not-so-hot takes and fluff. It's especially valuable for in-house B2B companies, but the same strategies apply for agencies and product-led teams. If you're responsible for making sure your brand stays visible and competitive, this course is for you. This course breaks down the entire AI search optimization playbook into seven key tactics. In each module, I'll show you why it matters for you and your brand, how to implement it step by step, and where it makes sense, how to use surfer tools to take care of the heavy lifting, from keyword strategy to content optimization, AI tracking, and more. You'll see real examples, walkthroughs, and demos so you can apply what you learn right away, even if SEO isn't your thing. You don't need to be an SEO expert to get value from this course. It's designed with that in mind. By the end of this course, you won't just understand AI search. You'll know how to win it. You'll walk away with the ability to strengthen your content so it's featured in AI answers, not left behind in traditional search. You'll also walk away with the skills to track and measure your brand's visibility in AI tools so you can finally see what's working and prove impact to your team. You'll get a future-proof strategy that keeps your brand top of mind no matter how fast search shifts. Most importantly, you'll leave with clarity and confidence. Instead of feeling overwhelmed by change, you'll know exactly what to do step-by-step step to lead your team and your brand into the next era of search. So, if you're ready to cut through the chaos, gain clarity, and master AI search optimization, let's dive in. You've probably heard the buzz. Search is changing, SEO is dead, Google is dying, ChatGPT is the new homepage. But how much of that is hype? and how much of it actually affects your brand's visibility. Let's take a look at what's really happening. We know that between mid-2024 and early 2025, traffic from AI tools surged by over 1,200%. Platforms like ChatGPT, Perplexity, and Gemini are becoming go-to places for getting answers and solving people's problems. Even Google's grip on search is starting to slip. I know, right? Didn't see that one coming. 
As I mentioned before, for the first time in a decade, its market share dipped below 90%. That also suggests that younger users, millennials, Gen Z, even Gen Alpha are leading the shift towards AI-powered answers. So what does that mean for your business? It means that when your potential customers ask a tool like ChatGPT, what's the best CRM for startups? Or who are the top cybersecurity providers in the US? Or how do I write a marketing strategy for SaaS? You want your brand to show up in the answer. But here's the kicker. Those tools don't show links. They generate answers. And unless your site has been seen, trusted, and indexed by these large language models, you're invisible. That's why we're here. This course is about AI search optimization. Simply put, it's how you adjust your content so tools like ChatGPT, Gemini, and Claude can find your website, understand what your brand does, and include you in the answers that they give to your future customers. Think of AI search optimization as the next evolution of SEO, not a replacement, but an added layer on top. Traditional SEO still matters. In fact, most AI tools pull from high-ranking content. But there are some key differences we'll dive into, and by the end of this course, you'll know exactly how to optimize for both. So whether you're leading a content team or managing overall growth, this shift matters. Because visibility is shifting too. Those who ignore it, are unprepared for it, or resist it will disappear like... Poof. Aren't you glad you're taking this course? Let's break down the difference between SEO and AI search optimization and why ranking in search is no longer enough. Here's the first thing to understand. AI search optimization isn't a one-to-one replacement for SEO. It builds on the same foundation, but it targets a different kind of search result. In traditional SEO, your goal is clear. Rank your page on Google, ideally in the top three positions. The user sees the title tag, clicks through to your website, and hopefully converts. But with AI search optimization, the user isn't choosing a link to click from a list on the search results page. They're asking a question inside a tool like ChatGPT or Google's AI overview. And that tool is generating a full answer, often without showing any clickable results. So your new goal? Get your brand or content included directly in the answer. That means optimizing for visibility in AI-generated responses, not just for ranking in a search engine. And here's what you should know. Most large language models are still pulling the information from public web content, often the same pages that rank well in Google. So yes, SEO still matters. A lot, actually. But AI search optimization introduces a new layer. First, the way AI reads and understands your content is different. It's trained on natural language, so conversational structure, clarity, and context all matter more than just keywords. Second, AI models care about authority. They're more likely to quote sites that they trust brands that have consistent online presence, entity signals, and content that demonstrates real experience and expertise. And third, traditional tracking doesn't work here. You can't rely on click-through rates or rankings. Instead, we're starting to measure brand mentions inside AI. Tools like Surfer's AI Tracker are helping marketers finally see where they show up and where they don't. So to recap, SEO gets you ranked. AI search optimization gets you mentioned. Both require trust, consistency, authority, and for you to meet a need, solve a problem, or to answer a question your audience has. They're different, but not so different at their core. In the next lesson, we'll look at how to make your brand recognizable to AI. So you're not just findable, you're feature-worthy.